that soundboards. Let's see what a bear sounds like. Yep, that's a bear. Oh yeah, that's definitely a bear. Okay, okay. All right, guys. I'm here at Amicalola. Made it to the lodge. Not to the lodge, the visitor center. The brand new visitor center. And I just registered my hike and uh, getting ready to hit the trail. But I just thought I'd show you guys where I'm at. They did a great job with this visitor center, man. Really nice facilities. I gotta fill up my water before I leave. I got some bathrooms here. Registration was right back, right back here. Had a nice little presentation. They taught people about leave no trace principles and you know, the nature of the trail and through hiking. So I sat for that. Listened to what they had to say and uh, just thank the trail crew for what they do. And uh, now I'm just gonna explore a little bit and show you guys what it's like around Amicalola these days. I'll pop in here. Hopefully they don't mind if I'm filming. Hello, how are you? Good, you ready for your hike? Oh yeah, so yeah, ready. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> this place is epic. Nice little gift shop. Ooh, they got a little cafe. I'm definitely gonna grab myself some caffeination. I, I slept like maybe six hours total on those two trains, two nights on the train. So I might not be going very big miles today, but I'll make it up to Springer. But first, I don't know if this place is open, but I'm gonna see if I can get some coffee. Anyway, I just wanted to show, show the vlog this place. Looks pretty cool. I completely missed, there's like a whole side of this place I didn't even, didn't even capture, but I'll do that now. It's like almost like a little AT museum. Got a little history about Amicalola here. Old pictures. Old gear. This looks like the Georgia section and a little topographical table here. How you doing, sir? This is pretty cool. This wasn't here last time I was here. <laughs> yeah. Last kickoff is still being built. It's pretty nice. Got some old gear. Show you what it's what it used to be like. Hiking the trail. Look at these old canteens. It's so cool. Look at that stove. Oh, I'm getting a lot of reflection, but yeah, look at that. It's nuts. Old carbide light. Man, things have changed. This place is cool. Definitely check out the visitor center. This is an old still. 65 gallon copper still. Man, got some old stuff in here. They did a great job building this place. Oh, we got we got soundboards. Let's see what a bear sounds like. Yep, that's a bear. Oh yeah, that's definitely a bear. Okay, okay. <laughs> well, there's lynx out here. Guys, I'm a cat lover. I would, I would be so happy if I saw a lynx. This deer is sniffing. What's a lynx sound like? Hmm. Well, that's what that's what a link sounds like, guys.
Very cool little displays in here. Snakes. Showing all the species of this area of the trail. I love it. Got myself a nice cup of coffee. I haven't had caffeine for over 24 hours. And I gotta say, it tastes pretty good. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I didn't even realize um, when I was scheduling like my through hike. I mean, today's March 2nd and there's like a whole kind of event going on here to kick off the through hiking season. So uh, that's pretty serendipitous. It's funny how things work out like that. But uh, yeah, there's like a lot of people here. Um, there's even people camping over here and apparently I could camp here. But I think I'm gonna hit the trail, honestly. Kinda just wanna get going. Um, do need to charge up my camera a little bit. So I might just hang out and like use the Wi-Fi. Yeah, there's people camping here, Hemakalola. So that's an option, I guess. Uh, really excited to be here. It feels surreal, honestly. Like all the prepping and planning, anticipation. And um, yeah, here I am, Hemakalola. It's really happening. So excited, so excited. Time to hike. The through hike begins today. Hello. Hey, nice to see you. You too. What's your name? Augie. 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 You? Nice to meet you. My name's Amitai. Nice to meet you, Amitai. Yeah. Pleasure. What you guys up to? Well, we actually came from Chattanooga. Some of us came from Asheville. Nice. And uh, we all lived together in community. Okay. What community? It's called the 12 Tribes. You ever heard of this? I have. Yeah, yeah. You ever visited us? I haven't. No. I'm through hiking, but I'm sure I'll see you guys along the way. I'll go to Yellow Deli, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Cool. And what was your name again? Augie. Augie. Yeah. Is that your trail name? No. It's my family calls me Augie. My real name's Austin. Oh, well. So it's like Augie Austin. Yeah. That's awesome. way. Don't have a trail name yet. But yeah. That is awesome. Yeah. I'm on my way to go to the arch. I was headed up, and then I realized I was like, I didn't get to the, you know, the thing, didn't do the arch thing, yeah. so, yeah. You care to read something on the way? I'll, I'll take it. It's, um, it just kind of really talks about our life and the heart of it, you know, like yeah. um, what we believe and how we live together. And I see, even yeah. Even the concept of a beehive. Okay, yeah. You know, like how the word church in Hebrew is adah, yeah, yeah. which means beehive. Not gonna lie, I appreciate it. I yeah. probably will end up just losing this, <laughs> like, I'm trying to minimize the stuff I take with me. I have a lot going on in my pack. I'm trying to just be mindful of what I take. Yeah, yeah. But I really like bees, and, I, and um, you can. You sure you don't want to keep it? You can I'm good. It's gonna get. It's. It's better off in someone else's hands. I'm sure. But I appreciate you. Nice to meet you. What was it again? Amatai. Amatai. Pleasure. All right. Oh, sorry. Have a beautiful day. Yeah, you too. I'll be walking by you guys in again momentarily. Here's a sticker. I'll, I'll be stopping in at the Yellow Deli, so yeah. Sure. I'll take a sticker. It's only point oh 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 one ounces. Yes, yes. You know, got to count those out. Everything adds up. <laughs> Have a good day, you guys. All right, the arch is in sight. There it is. <laughs> Last time I was here, I just like totally forgot to check out the arch. It's off. I was going. I actually was like just hiking up to the lodge and I was like, wait a minute, not again. Go that, that yeah, there it is. Woo! It's exactly We're doing it. It has begun. begun. I'm going to pop it on and go hike up to the trail, but nice, nice to meet you, nice Chris, meet you. the Ridge yeah. Runner from the I'll see you from in Virginia. Yeah. yeah, thank you, sir. Nice to meet you. What was her? Have a good one. You were? Bookie. Bookie. Pleasure to meet you. Good luck with the new hostel. So yeah, that was the arch. Meeting some cool people. I'll probably see later on up the trail. And uh, now I'm heading up to the lodge. 
So yeah, this is the new visitor center. This place is awesome. I got a cool sticker. Look at that. Sorry, I'm talking, <laughs> talking to myself. <laughs> So here we go. Out to the woods. Hello again. Hey. I got another sticker. Oh, great. I'm collecting them. Have a beautiful day. Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably see like small world, you know. Yeah, those were the 12 tribes folks. Seemed like nice people. Hey there. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Doing well, happy to be here. Thank you. They gave me a sticker, and then I turned around the corner and got another sticker. I'm a sticker collector today. What's going on, guys? I said hello. <laughs> So yeah, this year they got a little tent city going on here in Amicalola. You could pay just for this weekend, I think, to stay here. Or maybe it's going to continue, but got some nice folks camping over here. Making lots of friends already. I love the thru-hiking community. Everyone is just so embracing. This is the first bridge I'm going on on the AT. Ooh. Ah, all right, in my first steps on a trail, the approach trail. It's not going to include the famous stairs, or at least the approach trail stairs, or I don't know what I'm saying, um, at least half of them are still under construction. They're getting redone, so I won't be going on the stairs to the falls. Instead, I get to do this little side trail up to the lodge. And apparently, it's quite serendipitous. Um, this weekend, there's a kickoff of the through hiking season here at Anacolola. And up at the lodge, there will be a bunch of vendors and cool shenanigans going on. So, yeah, probably going to meet a bunch more cool folks up there. And then I'll be off to climb Springer and truly begin the adventure. Feels so good to be out here. It's supposed to be like 70% chance of rain. 45 degrees. It doesn't get any better than that. Hello. Hello. Goodbye. Greetings. How's it going? Pretty good. How are you guys? Not too bad. Oh, hello. <laughs> I would pet her, but... <laughs> Have a good day. Hello. Bye. Goodbye. Guys, I am feeling good. I'm happy it's not raining right now. But if it does, I'm still gonna be happy. Just happy to be here, you know? Practicing gratitude, practicing contentment. It's gonna be a big theme for me on this hike. You'll probably hear me talk about it a lot. I hope you're okay with that. Granted, I won't be spewing, you know, spewing it all the time, but definitely a uh, a good practice balanced contentment oh.
feels so good to get this fresh air into my lungs. I'm so excited to just see what is in store on this adventure. Like, who am I going to meet? What kind of friendships am I going to make? What's that one cliche phrase? The world is your oyster. It truly is. Am I the pearl? What's the pearls? The world is the oyster. I guess it's a multi-pearled oyster. Because there's a lot of beauty within. You just gotta know where to look. And how to look. That sign is seen better days. It says this way to Amicalola Falls. Onward. So I know I mentioned it in my previous video, but I am still learning how best to use this camera. So just bear with me in these first videos and just know that my intro video, that was literally my first time ever doing any significant recording of myself. And not gonna lie, I was nervous in the beginning and presenting myself in a certain way, speaking in a way that I don't normally speak. And in hindsight, looking at it, I kind of cringe a little, but it's just, you know, it's natural. I'm a newbie. What's going on, sir? I'm a newbie to the vlogging thing. So just bear with me. I got a learning curve to undergo, but I feel better about it now that I'm out here in the thick of it. So, I will be doing some uh, selfie shots, talking to the camera with my face included. And I will be also doing a lot of how I'm doing it now. Just capturing the trail, the faces, and uh, doing it from this point of view also. Got this nice shoulder strap attachment so I can record hands-free. Plan on using it. Yeah, I'll definitely be talking to you guys and showing my face as well going to be a lot of fun creating this this vlog I do intend to do it the whole way so cast your votes will I continue to vlog despite the hardships we shall see Yeah, guys, this is the new trail to Amicalola Lodge for now. If you get here anytime soon, you will have an excuse to not go up those stairs. I like the stairs. Being next to all that running water, it's good for the soul. Puts hair on the chest, as my father would say, about just about anything. I can hear the falls. Hopefully we still get to see them. Not sure how this is gonna look when we get to the to that point or if we'll get close enough. It's cool though, because it's new, you know? 
I was here last year for a, a lash, aka long ass section hike. Started as a through attempt, but got off trail around mile marker 500. But uh, anyway, so I'm revisiting this and it's like it's new because this trail wasn't here. So neither was any of that stuff down there. Which makes it nice. And don't worry, I won't always be talking incessantly. I'm just excited right now and I have a lot to say, I suppose. Starting to get a little warm. Hello. I'll let you guys go. Not gonna lie, I feel a little bit out of shape. But that's to be expected. The last few months I've just been in the comfort zone. I did a little training at the gym, but not enough. I'll be fine. I'm in good shape, but Yeah, there's going to be a couple weeks of fatigue before I really get into the groove, I think. How we doing, folks? Good, how are you? <laughs> Starting to sweat a little. <laughs> Not take long. No. So did I miss the falls back there? Yeah, they um they have it blocked off. Oh, okay. I, I thought so. Didn't know if I just didn't see something. But yeah. That's all right. Well, sorry vlog viewers, you're not going to get to see the actual waterfall. Uh, I was talking to my... I'm making a vlog. I'm making a vlog. <laughs> no, no, you're part of... it's all good. Would you like me to cut you guys out of the video? Okay. You may or may not end up on, on YouTube. <laughs> I always like to ask, you know, to try to be courteous. Well, just saying, like, 
Time for oh, hey, that's why you know. Oh yeah, those are those are big birds. Yeah, I, I've seen some big sandhill cranes. Beautiful birds. They're the biggest crane, I think, right? They're making a comeback too. They were almost, or they were endangered. I have in the past, but are you able to this right now? Oh, up here, right? Yeah, well, that's good. So I will be able to show that I saw it last year I was here in April before the renovations and I was, tell I was saying like well now I have an excuse not to go up those stairs I guess <laughs> are they like busted up right now oh yeah yeah well, that's not very leave no trace of them. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna pause the video here just to save some some uh, storage and keep the keep the vlog concise. But this has been the trail, most of the trail up to the lodge. I'll turn it back on when I get to the bridge and show you the waterfall. So, still on the trail going up to the lodge, just took a pause to shed my layers. My fleece plus rain jacket was making me sweat going up this hill. And that was interesting down there when I went to the arch. The 12 tribes, people were down there doing their, uh, doing their thing, preaching the word. It's funny that they're, that they're here. They're certainly tenacious. You know, I just heard a lot about them from other hikers' vlogs and Kyle hates hiking's podcast, etc. So that was interesting to meet them. They seem like nice people. Lots of eye contact, and you know, they had their pamphlets and their stickers, which I tried to gracefully decline. But I did take the sticker. Hello. Hey, how's it going? Doing well. How are you guys? Good. Have a good day. So that was interesting, me and them. But uh, still making my way to the lodge. It's beautiful out here. Look at this fog. Come on, flip it around. There we go. Yeah, look at the fog. I didn't realize I was zoomed there. That explains the up close and personal shot of my nostrils. But I just wanted to chime in. I was having some thoughts about 12 tribes and my experience here so far. It's been a beautiful trail up to the lodge. I gotta say, like, I'm digging it. The stairs are nice, but this is just different. Misty. I think I'm getting close up here. You can see a guardrail. Oh yeah, very close. I'm gonna clip you guys back into my backpack here.
we'll see what's going on with this through hiking season kickoff meet all of the good people of the community Hello. Thank you. Oh. My legs are feeling strong, guys. Point three miles down of the approach. Let's go. Way do I want to go? This way. It is uh, busy, busy, busy around here today for the send off. But it's awesome. I've met some really cool people. That guy back at the yard, he was briefly on camera. His name was Chris. Um, when I was on the trail last year, I was following in his footsteps. He was actually a trail runner. Hello. Okay, how's it going? Good. How are you guys? Pretty good, pretty good. Yeah. Bear country. Yeah. Gotta watch out around here. Oh, come on. I'm trying to get the camera to pan down. There we go. I got the camera on tilt lock mode, which keeps it super stable while it's attached to my backpack and it's nice but sometimes when I want to show things that are lower or higher down I have to just manually adjust it so anyways how are you guys doing hello hi anyways um yeah that gentleman down by the arch his name was Chris he was a ridge runner in the Smokies last year and uh, I was seeing his thoughts and writings and all of the journals and all the shelters and man had some nice handwriting. Hello, how are you guys? <laughs> I told him that and he seemed like a, seemed like a nice dude. So it was just interesting to see someone that like I have vicariously gotten to know through log books at the shelters like it's just one of those cool things about through hiking that you know you wouldn't really think about it but i just think that's amusing as soon as he said oh i was the ridge runner in the smokies i was like oh my gosh i loved your writing in the journals if you've never hiked the at there are shelters all along and in most of the shelters there are log books and in the log books, you can leave your signature or thoughts. Hello. And uh, his thoughts were always just very mindful. Just trying to help hikers out and let them know what's going on in the area. So. Greetings. Good, how are you guys? Excuse me, good, how are you? Lots of folks out here today. It's nice. It might be getting old to you guys, but I like to greet people. I try to be sociable. It's not always going to be that way. Like, obviously, I'm I'm uh, fresh on the trail and jubilant. Currently jubilant. So, <laughs> you know, I'm trying to be nice and say hi to people, but. There will come a time when that won't be the reality. <laughs> I'll probably be putting my head down and trucking on, but just a lot of people around here, so. You never know who you're gonna meet. A friendly smile can manifest all kinds of destinies. It's gotten me many an opportunity just by being human. Look at that. Trying to pan up. 
like a trail going up and up there there's like a uh, pan pan it's like a rusted out truck in a tree up there That's where That's where oh really yeah. wow <laughs> good luck getting out of there it's, the tree has like grown into it look at that yeah. that's wild like how does that even happen look at that uh i hope they were okay that's an old that is, that is so cool though, like the tree's just grasping it. Like, That's not a piece of the truck, is it? Oh, actually, it probably, I mean, it looks like guardrail. It looks like an old guardrail. It matches the color. Anyways, that's interesting. That does look just like the front, front end of it. Is it? Yeah, I know it might be. Yeah, because it's got these like clips. Yeah, I think it is, but the front, the front used it as the front Yeah, you know, here's what you got. Have a beautiful day. That was interesting. There's like a cold rusted out truck up there just with a tree grown around it. It's pretty neat. Wow, that is magnificent. I can see why, um, I can see why they, why people come here for the approach trail. That's just freaking gorgeous, man. And that's where all the mist is coming from as well. So yeah, Amalakalola, Amalakalola. Amicalola Falls, folks. But it's not just Amicalola Falls. It's Amicalola Falls with me. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, the wonders of nature. But I ain't gonna wear myself out. I'm just grateful that someone before me recognized the special nature of this place and chose to set it aside and uh, preserve it, you know? So there are still some stairs, guys. You just take a trail to the stairs. So that's where I just came from. And this is where I'm going. I got a hip to you. Uh, Do not cross fence. You don't say. Who would want to cross that fence? Look at that. This is surreal, guys. I am elated right now, like, climbing those stairs, feeling the burn. It's becoming real. I'll say that. <laughs> Beautiful day to be out here. Just misty. Haven't gotten rained on yet. It's just ideal. Love and life. I'm loving life. My pack's heavy, but my heart is light. All right. <laughs>